In this video I'll be telling you how I got the rarest title in the game and how you can easily get it too. Also, it's not an admin slash YouTuber's title since the average player will never get it. Anyway, let's start. Alright so the rarest title is Pirate King, which is the hardest title to get, not including exclusive titles. To get this title, you must have a crew that stays in the top 10 leaderboards for approximately 72 hours. To get in the top 10s of the leaderboard, you and 29 other crew members need 30 million bounty. Just in case they increase the bounty cap in the future, basically you and 29 other crew members need the maximum amount of bounty. Also, you'll only have 15 member slots when you first make a crew, which won't get you in the top 10s. You can buy the extra 15 member slots from the NPC located behind the Great Tree or Graveyard Island. In total I'm pretty sure it's like 18,000 fragments to get the extra 15 member slots, but correct me if it's more or less. That is what you'll need, and the hardest part is definitely getting 29 30 million bounty players to join your crew. And for the cherry on top, you or your crew members can't lose any bounty while you're AFK for approximately 72 hours in Blocks Fruits, or you won't be in the top 10s. I had to kick around 10 crew members because they lost bounty, meaning I wasn't in the top 10s anymore. Also, once you're in the top 10s, you will have to be AFK slash play Blocks Fruits for approximately 72 hours till you finally get the title. I had to AFK for around 62 and not 72 hours till I got the title, so that was pretty nice. So yeah that's how you can get Pirate King. In short, get a crew to the top 10s of the bounty leaderboard, be AFK and Blocks Fruits for approximately 72 hours while also maintaining that position on the leaderboard. If you lose your spot being top 10 or lower on the leaderboard, the timer will freeze. For example, if you were AFK for 35 hours and someone left at that moment, the timer of AFKing will freeze. So once you get back to the top 10s, you'll only have approximately 37 hours of AFK, since you already previously did 35 hours of AFK. And yeah, that's how you get the Pirate King title. Anyway guys that's the end of this video. If you found this video useful, please consider liking and subscribing, it'd greatly help me. Anyway, bye.